Firefighters often say it's not the fire that usually kills, it's the smoke inhalation, and that goes for our pets too. But as 7 Action News reporter Kimberly Craig shows us now, a downriver animal hospital is making moves to save the animals we love. Here at the Woodhaven Animal Hospital, they're already using acupuncture and chiropractic therapies for animals, and now they're introducing something new. It's absolutely incredible. Dr. Ronald Lyman training the veterinary staff here at the Woodhaven Animal Hospital on their newest piece of equipment, a hyperbaric chamber just for animals and said to be a first here in Michigan. If we can get results, if we can help, it should be an option. That's how we feel. And this state-of-the-art hyperbaric chamber can be used to treat everything from pancreatitis to smoke inhalation and wound therapy for dogs like Jake, a rescue who had to have a leg amputated. It turns on your natural healing cascades, it reduces the inflammation in your body. Dr. Lucretia Greer also making this hyperbaric chamber available to pets that have been rescued from fires. And in a few months, when firefighters call ahead, they'll have the chamber ready 24 hours a day. If there is an animal drowned, fire victim, if they can get them to the chamber, we will help them at no cost. With smoke inhalation, uh, you know, this hyperbaric chamber will actually help the long-term problems with these carbon monoxide poisoning smoke inhalation. Zoe's owner is hoping this chamber will help with her paralysis and other issues she developed from spinal meningitis. I'm so excited because if she can walk again, that we can have a life. If they wanted us to put her down, we would never put her down. We didn't rescue her for that. I just want to set a new standard, a new precedent, and, and let people know that there are options and we won't stop until we can we can figure out something that we can do to help their pet. For more information on the hyperbaric chamber they're using here at the Woodhaven Animal Hospital, go to our website at WXYZ.com. In Woodhaven, Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News. Meantime.